The G made sawback is basically a model of a Willys Jeep. Uh, I'd say about a CJ3. If you have a divider in the window, it'd be a CJ2. But to make it appear like this, more like a scale Jeep, you need to cut the fender and the front a little differently than are marked. You can do this even after you've built the Jeep by just going back. You can lay out the lines with blue tape until you get it all even and everything where you want it. And uh, this trim adds a lot to the looks of the vehicle. If you go online, you can look at pictures of Willie's Jeeps and you'll see exactly how you need to cut to have a more scale appearance. The other thing is a lot of guys are leaving their windshield frames black because it's easy. But if you prime this, you can put the same paint as your body onto the windshield frame and it really adds something because uh, that's how Jeeps were sold. The windshield frames match the body color. Now, another thing is, although this is a one-tenth scale crawler, one-tenth class, it's not really one-tenth scale. If you measure the body and work back from, uh, from the full-size measurements to the scale body here, this is one-seventh scale. <coughs> So if you use one-tenth scale accessories and figures, they're not going to look right. They're going to look too small. A tenth scale figure is about seven inches, and it's going to look like your Jeep's being driven by a member of the Lollipop Guild. So uh, this was a 10-inch figure that was cut down and uh, rejointed, and uh, he's exactly the right scale. If you look at pictures of people in their Willys Jeeps, you'll see exactly what I mean. And you'll also notice that you can add your frame sliders without taking away from the appearance at all. So the other thing is uh, light buckets. I machined the two for the taillights, but the headlight buckets that I used were from uh, Mini Mag Lights. They're $2 a piece from one of the uh, suppliers online. And you drill them out to fit the LEDs. Um, <clears throat> G-Made is making light buckets, but they're not out on the market yet. And you can do other fun things, like uh, I've got a side mount spare, which is a lot of trouble, because it required a lot of reinforcing inside. But uh, anyhow, just a few thoughts to help you make your G-Made sawback uh, more of a scale Jeep.